eating low carb does not have to be boring. So let's do a seven minute prep lamb skewer. See you on the inside. Hey, it's Chef Alexia. I'm here to teach you how to cook. So if you're new, make sure that you subscribe and you will find this recipe right below. Let's start with the lamb. I'm gonna put some gloves on. I have chosen lamb shoulder. This is a cheaper cut, but it's perfect for those skewers. So it has some bones because it is a cheaper cut. What we're gonna do is just fabricate this real quick. I have a cutting board here that is uh, prepared for meat. It's red. I like to use this type of cutting board uh, just to differentiate and not mix and have any contamination. All right, so I'm gonna use my boning knife. You could use a regular chef knife and I'm just gonna go around the bones. You just go against the bones with the tip of your knife. And we're gonna cut it in one inch cubes. You could leave the fat on this one because when it's in the oven, it's actually gonna help it get more moist. Some butchers might do this for you. I just, uh, I like to butcher, so. All right, now we're gonna put this inside this bowl. I'm gonna remove one of the gloves. I'm gonna add a little bit of olive oil. This is called La Diviosas, and you could find it at greekbiostore.com. This is actually made from where I come from, so I'm very proud to represent them. We're gonna add some coarse salt. Okay, and in this mortar, I have fennel seeds, cumin seeds, and a little bit of spicy pepper. This is not traditional Greek. This is another recipe that I'm using. I just wanted to use fennel and cumin and give such a great aroma and we just ground them to release all the flavors, okay? And we're gonna add that in. This is a recipe straight out of my book. You can find it at oneweekchef.com. I have 84 more low-carb, sugar-free, grain-free, and gluten-free recipes there. All right, we're gonna mix that together, make sure that all the flavors are together. I have a hotel pan with a little bit of aluminum foil and a rack on top. I like to do that because uh, lamb usually has a lot of fat, so when it drips down, it's gonna create a little bit of smoke and give flavor to the lamb. We're gonna use a metal skewer. If you have wooden skewers, just make sure that you soak them in water a little bit so they don't splinter, and also they're not gonna burn in the oven. If you have a smaller piece, just fold it under like that and then just skewer it. You could put this straight on the grill or cook it under the broiler or at 350 until it's completely done, which is gonna be about 15, 20 minutes. I cooked the lamb skewers on broiler and they came out perfectly. I just had to flip them midway so it gets color everywhere. Now I let them rest a little bit as well, about 10 minutes, because then the juices go back inside and the skewer is much easier to handle. What I like to do with the skewers is just take a plate and make sure that I remove them. You just use your fork and then slide right off. Wow, that looks insane. If you wanna see more quick recipes, low carb, just like this one, make sure that you hit the notification button, like, subscribe, and leave me a comment below with a recipe that you would like to see next. If you like this one, I have 84 more at oneweekchef.com at my e-cookbook.